Energy resources are mostly used to generate electricity. Non-renewable energy resources will run out one day. However, renewable energy resources will never run out. Examples of renewable energy are wind, solar, water, waves, biofuel, hydroelectricity, tides, and geothermal. Examples of non-renewable energy are coal, oil, and gas. Let's go through these different types of energy. Wind, it is renewable. The advantages are that it has no fuel cost once it's set up, then there is no pollution. However, disadvantages is that it's not always reliable as it's not always windy, they can be noisy, and some people think they are ugly. Solar. It is renewable. The advantages are there's no fuel cost once set up, no pollution produced. The disadvantages, however, is expensive to set up and you get no energy at night. Geothermal. It is renewable. The advantage is there's no fuel cost once set up and no pollution is produced. The disadvantages are that there's very few areas where it is accessible. You have now learnt about renewable and non-renewable energy resources and the advantages and disadvantages of wind, solar and geothermal. You'll find a summary of this information below. Make sure you test yourself using the quiz on reviseitright.com. Let's go through some more energy types. Hydroelectricity, i.e. falling water. It is renewable. The advantages as no fuel cost once it's set up, no pollution, and it's easily controlled. However, the disadvantages are that it requires flooding land to build, which could destroy habitats. Wave power. It is renewable. The advantages are that there's no fuel cost once it's set up and no pollution. However, the disadvantages is it can damage marine ecosystems and not everywhere is near water. Tidal. Tidal barrages using gravity. It is renewable. The advantages is that it has no fuel cost once set up, no pollution and is reliable. The disadvantages, however, is it can damage marine ecosystems and not everywhere is near water. You have now learnt about the advantages and disadvantages of hydroelectric, wind power and tidal power. You'll find a summary of this information below. Make sure you test yourself using the quiz on reviseitright.com. Let's go through some more ways to generate energy. Biofuels. They are renewable. The advantages are that they're low cost, readily available and carbon neutral. However, large scale land use is needed, which requires lots of water. And also destruction of habitats is needed to grow crops. Fossil fuels, i.e. coal, oil and gas. They are not renewable. The advantage is that it's low cost, easily transportable and reliable. However, it produces large amounts of carbon dioxide and it produces some sulfur dioxide. Nuclear it is not renewable. However, the advantages are they generate a lot of electricity and they're reliable. However, the disadvantages are that it's expensive to construct and run and produces dangerous radioactive waste. You have now learnt about the advantages and disadvantages of biofuels, fossil fuels and nuclear power. You'll find a summary of this information below. Make sure you test yourself using the quiz on reviseitright.com. Why are we the best revision website out there? Well, because we have it all in one place. Revision notes, summary videos, longer, more detailed videos for topics you're struggling on. Exam question walkthrough videos, where qualified teachers take you through the perfect answers to exam questions. Worksheets, quizzes, computer marked exam questions interactive flashcards, forums, the ability to keep track on where you are using our tick list and so much more. But that's not all. We run at least three live lessons a week and closer to exam time, this will be more, where you can tune into a qualified teacher teaching lots of different topics each week. The lessons will be interactive and we go through exam questions and quick quizzes to ensure understanding as you go. We also run drop-in sessions where you can drop in, ask a tutor anything live, 
get the answer that you need and leave. These are included in our silver and gold membership. This means that for an extra £10 a month, you can access at least 12 hours of lessons a month. That's under £1 an hour, which is incredibly cheap. Still not convinced? Try us completely free for seven days and cancel any time. Completely free of charge. We offer this because we're convinced that you'll love us. So try us now.